All right, so we made it inside of the house. Here's your main front door. Got a cool transom window up there. Somebody did a pretty bad job of painting that. Yeah, nice front door. Hardware there has been updated. Nice trim around these doors here. Oh wow, look at this. Even have an archway there that leads to the staircase. We'll head upstairs later. Some more nice trim going into this room here. Well, let's head this way first. So I assume this would have been like a living room. Nice big room with big original windows. You can have some crown molding up there. That was definitely added later though. Yeah, these are old windows here. And I don't know, you guys will notice every window in the house is numbered, which I find strange. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Look at the baseboards there, over a foot tall. Now, unfortunately, the original hardwood floors are covered up in this asbestos tile. Yeah, and it's crumbling there, so we have to be careful not to disturb that too much. Another nice window there. You have three different layers of wallpaper there, and then the original plaster. See some of the lath board there. Oh wow, look at that. This house is constructed with square nails, which means it was built before 1880. I'm gonna do some research on this place and find out exactly when it was built. That's a pr pretty boring light fixture, jeez. Nice thick trim here. And this comes back into the front entryway. So let's head over here. Got some more nice original windows here. Now I assume this is probably the dining room because through that door there is the kitchen. Let's see some more old retro wallpaper here. Yeah, look at those old square nails. This is a really old house. This is pretty cool too. You have this built-in cabinet. And I bet behind this wall, they've covered up a fireplace. Because why else would the wall go out like that? Bet that's the chimney. Yeah, this is pretty cool too. Nice to see the original windows. ceiling fan up there and again the original floors have sadly been covered up we we'll take a look at this got some old hardware on that door yeah look at the decay on there I wonder what that was, maybe for a, like a thermostat or alarm panel or something. That's pretty cool too, the old grate down there. Have some really retro tiles in there. And just a little closet. Got some hooks there, some shelves. Okay, let's head into the kitchen. Wow, yeah, this is really decayed in here. Oh, that's cool, we have another archway there. 
Yeah, this looks really cool with all the peeling paint. Okay, so this is like a little pantry kind of thing in there. And all the cupboards out of the kitchen have been removed. Oh, look at the old flooring down there. That's pretty cool. Yeah, so you can see where the tiles were on the wall. And they removed those. And again, we have another nice original window. It's too bad the glass is broken on these. Oh, there we can get a look at what these tiles look like. They're just white tiles. Yeah, they're not even real. They're just like, uh, like the peel and stick tiles or whatever. You can see up there where the cupboards were. Oh, look at that up there. There's an old wallpaper border with some fruit on it. That's really cool. Goes all the way around. I guess this was the sink here, yeah. There's the drain line, and then hot and cold. Got another old vent there. I don't know which way, let's go this way here first. So you have some steps down into this room. This door here goes into the basement. I'm like 90%, 95% sure that goes into the basement because there's no other way to get there. And that's screwed onto there pretty good. So unfortunately, we can't get down there because the door has to swing out towards us. So with that board there, can't open it. Got not, another old door here. Again, they've updated the hardware. Okay, you can see here it's just brick underneath the plaster. And this window is number two. Even all the glass and everything's, the frame and everything's gone. So I'm not sure what the point of that was. Looks like they had a wood stove set up here. That's where the pipe would have gone out. This is window number one. That looks like a really old window. With the 12 over 12 panes. Oh, I just noticed there's some wainscoting in here too. Yeah, look at the, how they boarded up this door with all those two by 12s. And they put a huge oil tank in front of the door. Here's the hot water heater. Ceiling fan up there. Yeah, that, that's gotta be the basement there. Unless this goes to the basement, maybe that's what this is. I thought this was just a cupboard though, yeah. It's just like a little closet. Oh, look at there's some of the original hardwood floors down there. That's pretty cool. Yeah, usually the basement stairs are somewhere like this underneath the main staircase, right? That's strange. Okay, so we've got a bathroom here. Bunch of extra tiles down there. There's the shutters from the window. Toilets flipped over. Got a cupboard there. Oh wow, look at this. Cloth up bathtub there. And then you have the old shower curtain that goes around. Oh, it's even still there. That's pretty cool.
Oh wow, look at this door knob. So that's made of wood, right? This one on the other side. Yeah, those are beautiful. Glad to see nobody's painted them over the years. Squeeze through this opening here. Got another nice original window. Most of the glass still intact. But wow, yeah, they did a bad job of painting these. Somebody didn't use tape. Just a single light bulb up there. And again, the original floors have all been covered up. I guess this door's original. Because of the old knob. It seems odd to have such a big pane of glass back then. So maybe the window part was cut in or replaced. Again, you have really tall baseboards in here too. Yeah, the decay in here is unreal. This place has been empty for a long time. Okay, well, let's head straight upstairs. This might be a bit of a shorter video because we don't have the basement either. This is a pretty cool old heritage house that I thought I'd show you guys. this here. It's pretty cool. Look at some of the woodwork there. Nothing phenomenal, but still pretty cool to see. Come in here. Got another one of those nice doorknobs. Now I think the last time I showed these, I thought that they were stone. And then Tommy corrected me and said that they were wood. But now, looking at it again, pretty sure, certain that is wood. Oh yeah, look at this here. It's just the brick with a plaster on it. And there's a big, huge beam here. Look at that, that's hand chopped with an ax. That shows the age of the home. Another nice original window here. Come around. Wow, look at, you know what this is? Raccoons climbing up into the attic. I ain't got knob and tube wiring. Is there anything up there? I don't know, I can't see. But yeah, look at how the raccoons have been climbing up this wall. Up here you have original floors, but unfortunately they've been painted many times. You can see all the different layers of paint. A metal doorknob there. Let's come through here. We have another bedroom. Okay, we can see up into the attic a bit there too. Oh, look at the chimney up there. How they just like randomly put bricks together like that. That looks pretty bad. Wallpaper border around there. See some of the original lath and plaster there. The square nails and look at, look at how thick these beams are here now. And this is actually four inches wide. Now when you go and buy a two by four, it's like three and a half inches. Oh, I thought these were like walnuts at first, but you know what that is? They had like cork board on the walls. Yeah, again, just bare light bulbs that would have been up there. Another original door. Ooh, look at the retro wallpaper in here. And the linoleum floor. Oh, it's like maple leaves. And then you have 
this really old retro wallpaper. Let me know in the comments how old this is. I'm gonna guess maybe 50s or 60s. Uh, yeah, you can see right outside. Surprised there isn't a lot of water damage here though from that. Guess there is a little bit up there. Ooh, a lot of black mold over there. Okay, over here, we can see some original floors. They've been painted kind of like an orange color, but still nice to see. Multiple layers of wallpaper here. Jeez, even more layers up there. Closet here. It's in really bad shape. Let me come back here. This is just part of the hallway. It's kind of a cool window. Yeah, it like swings, swings out so you can open the window right up. It's cool. DK in here. There's the plumbing stack. Old cast iron pipes. Yeah, a lot of wallpaper and stuff coming down here. And then that brings us back around to our staircase here. Got kind of like stucco on this wall. Didn't even notice that. Yeah, so. Did we look at this room here? Can't remember. I think so. Cool. Well, maybe we didn't look at this room. I don't know. Pretty cool old wallpaper. It's definitely a kid's room. Oh, that's cool. Look at the light switches. These are from like the 1920s, these light switches. Really cool. Wow, really decayed over there. Look at that black mold starting. All right, well, that's gonna wrap it up for this house. So thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you guys on the next adventure.